Hey, how we doing everybody? This is Brian here. First video I've uploaded in a very long time, other than a couple shorts here and there. I'm trying to get back into this whole YouTube thing. Um, figured I'd start out with a bang. Got the brand new Vosteed Mini Nightshade. Got this in a couple of days ago. Uh, uh, about two days ago. Been dying to break into it ever since. So let's do just that. Went ahead and took the cellophane off of it to spare you all the horrors of hearing that through your microphone or through your speakers. Um, of course, typical box from Vosteed. Um, you do have sticker, patch, cloth, but the mini nightshade does come with the extra set of Omega Springs in there. I don't know if that's coming into focus or not. You do get those in here. New pouch with Vosteed. This one just, all in all, it just feels like it is a better quality pouch. You do get the little patch there with the Velcro section. Um, you've got the new bright orange insides kind of gives you a little bit on the knife as well carbon fiber as 35 VN again keeping with that orange and black theme from Vosteed you do have the orange backspacer the orange thumb studs A little bit of oil off there. Thought I uh, thought I'd have some on here. <laughs> right out of the box, action on this thing is absolutely great. Never have an issue with just about anything I've ever gotten from them. I've owned every single release that they've done Boss Deed always seems to knock it out of the park uh, you and his team are uh, are second to none in my opinion when it comes to stuff like that and then if there is a problem customer service takes care of it It's uh, it's been an absolute pleasure working with them guys uh, anytime I've ever had a question or anything like that um, so size comparisons figure we would just bring in the uh, the bigger brother here this is my purple G10 thumbhole nightshade. See, lining them up here, they are not much different in size. Um, I'd say overall, you know, again, I'm not a I'm not a big uh, numbers person, so I don't really you can't tell really much by telling somebody that oh it's a half an inch difference, but when you can see it sitting here, yeah. You know, Again, it is <laughs> it is about a half inch difference. It looks like to me. Line them up here. Pivot to pivot. So again, the blade shapes are very much identical. Um, you've got a little more of a down sweep in the mini. I guess, you know, just because it is a smaller blade, you get that, but that's going to be absolutely epic for doing any sort of draw cuts or anything like that, any any sort of utility cut, which where the nightshade really shines is in just the daily performance anyway. Form factors other than that are very much spot on with each other. Of course, Nightshades always has that perfect action right out of the box. And this one, no different. Reverse flicking is cake. Thumb action, beautiful. Um, I'm guessing there's a fair amount of oil <laughs> on the internals of these things, which there always is. So you do, at least I am right out of the box, getting just a hair of lock stick, and I mean it is minimum. You might even be able to hear it. Let's see. I don't know if you could hear that or not. 
but I am getting just again just a hair of lock stick right out of the box other than that it is just an absolutely awesome little knife doesn't weigh anything um, I don't know the exact again I don't know the specs right out of hand it's I mean it's definitely less than two ounces um, yeah I'm, I'm the type of person where I'm always wearing basketball shorts it's pretty much all I wear to work and everything else so a really light knife like this is going to be it's just going to be epic it's going to disappear and then you got the S35 VN good performance steel not ridiculously hard to sharpen um, the way they did their carbon fiber here just it looks absolutely gorgeous hopefully we're in focus here again you do have the reversible pocket clip on the nightshade for the first time um, clip is not inset but you have flush screws um, so it shouldn't be any issue And if you do not know about the uh, the Vostead uh, locks here, the crossbar locks that they use, it is an adjustable lock. So you can certainly adjust that tension specs as you need to see fit. All right, everyone. Well, again, I want to thank you guys for taking the time to uh, to watch my video here. Bear with me while I get back into the swing of this stuff. Um, it's not something I've done in a long time. If you uh, if you want to subscribe, definitely go ahead and do so. There's going to be a lot more content, and, and you know, of course, just like with every channel, things are just going to get better from here. Uh, if you could just give me a like, and uh, we'll talk to you guys next time.